This video focuses on sending annuity payment information to CPI. Now in AppCall, we have a couple of reports that have been created in your reports module that will be set up to be sent to CPI. First is a report of all your matters, regardless of status. It's going to send all your matters to them with the issue date so they know how to set up the annuities. And then there'll be an incremental report that'll be sent that just shows the changes since the last time it was sent. To set these up, what we're going to do is you're going to hover over the reports tab and you're going to click manage report schedules. Next, you're going to click add. You're going to select the report dropdown and you're going to come down and you're going to see there's six CPI annuity reports. One is for sending all matters. One is foreign or non-US matters. One is for US matters. So you would determine which of these three to use based on whether you do foreign patents or just domestic. So we're going to select all matters in this example. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to pick spreadsheet. Make sure we attach the spreadsheet, which is what they need. And we're going to put in an email address. Put in mine, for example. And you need to select some value of select days, or in this case, select days of the week, whatever it may be. We need to select some value. Next, we're going to click send report now. And this email address is going to be whatever email address CPI has provided you. It is not obviously mine or your own email address. Your representative will provide you with one. And you're going to click send report now. And it went ahead and sent the report to the email address that you would have selected. Again, this is for all your matters. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to pick the incremental option. So we're going to hover over report. We're going to select all matters modified since last report. Now you're going to pick when you want these set and you would work with CPI to find out if they want you just send this report to them weekly, monthly, quarterly, whatever it would be. As this example, we're going to go ahead and pick that we're going to have it set to CPI on the first of every month. You pick your time zone and your time of day. You want that set. Again, make sure that spreadsheet is attached. And it's going to likely be the same email address you set the full backup to. Now we're just going to click save. And you have this in your scheduled list now. This will be sent out, in this case, on the first of every month at 12 a.m. And it will attach the CSV they need, and you should be good to go. Those are the only steps that are required. I hope this helps. Thank you, and have a great day.